Urgent real-time Bitcoin and stock market forecast. Why is the Bitcoin and stock market falling? This is the ES1, which is the S&P 500. We fell from here to here. We did kind of a retrace back up, but we're bearish again. Why? We got rejected over this line. This is a neckline that's supposed to be bullish because this is a, yep, descending broadening wedge. There's a V here. And uh, we just got rejected. So we should keep going down. But the weird part is that this happened, this happened, and nobody talked about the fact that OPEC canceled their meeting. So now it's like, News is totally unreliable. All the news that you need to make decisions is just not out there until after this happens. We told everybody to dump here. In fact, uh, for our Korean market and for our members at here and here, ko-fi.com slash OTT Bitcoin, we told everyone to dump on Friday. So uh, we, dumped right about, we dumped right about here, which is nice for us. This is Bitcoin price. Uh, dumped and then everyone's like, ha-ha, you guys dumped and we're going to keep going up to all-time hot dupe. Oh, I guess not. And everyone lost money. And stocks here, we dumped all our stocks on Friday as well. So we did pretty good, but um, everything's dumping because let me show you why. From a technical standpoint, this is what's happening. This is all you need to know on, well, I guess I'll show, you, I'll show you both. Here's the S&P 500. If we zoom out, and we zoom out, and we zoom out, here we are. You see why we dumped? Oh, you don't yet? Let me show you in more detail. Here, this is why we dumped. You see now? Uh, okay, here it is. See, look, this was the all-time high for the year. Okay, this is the all-time high. And then we had an almost all-time high. And then we beat the all almost all-time high. But we didn't hit the all-time high. So, those generally mark the tops. All-time high, almost as high, but generally higher than the previous almost all-time high. So it goes high, almost high, higher than almost high. Just remember that sequence, it's a harmonic. High, oh, almost high. Higher than almost high, but still, it, and then boof, dump. So this is the stock market, and it was timed perfectly for OPEC. So these guys manipulate the stock market like this all the time, it's just, just get used to it. Uh, what about Bitcoin? Let me show you how you would have known to dump Bitcoin or how we knew to dump Bitcoin. Um, eh, here it is. Actually, this is way too big. Uh, I'm going to do this and this and this. Look, you see it now? I mean, it's pretty clear, right? <sighs> no, you don't see it yet? Let me zoom in. Let me stretch this up a little further. And if you still don't see it, let me spell this out for you. You know those uh, cool little wave things where they see O T D T S W W W S O W W S and this is bullshit for us. show of weakness, show us forget that. It's because you can't look at something and say, oh look, that's weakness. Oh look, that's strength. You just can't do that. It's just it's just something that people used to do in the 1950s to sound smart and people still think it's possible. You can't look. But this is what happened. We hit a high. But when we hit that high, you see, you see this price action in here? This price action broke all the other stuff. It just went higher, 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 higher. But how did we, how did we go up here? This is what's important. Right in here, this, this little range in here. Let me zoom this. I'm going to spread those legs apart and show you. I mean, you guys are af literally afraid to spread these candle legs apart. You just got to take these candles and just sh show the candles who's the man here in the relationship. And just take it, uh, take these candles uh, by the candle holder and just spread them apart. Literally, you got to get right up in there. Get, get your nose right up in all these candles. <sighs> and now, now you're starting to see it, right? Oh, you still don't see it? Now you will. Look. You take this point, and you take this point, and what do you got? It's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. Yeah. Now you see it. You got a perfect head and shoulders. Ta-da! That's it. Tiny left shoulder, big head, right shoulder. Doesn't quite get up to the, to the height of the shoulder. Now, you have to look at everything like this. Because the stock market doesn't know the difference between 0 degrees and 32 degrees. It just doesn't care. This is a trend. So is this. So is this. It's all a trend. Look at everything from a trend perspective. How far is this away from the trend line? 
that's uh, uh, this much. What about this? That's about 320% away from the trend line, then this. And what about this? This is about uh, 786 away from this trend line. Hey, so this is bearish pressure. What was weird and surprising to me, and I've never seen this but before, uh, so we just changed our algorithm because we lost a little money. We shorted here and then we're like, huh, that's weird. It's not dumping. We should be dumping because we have this head and shoulders. We have a channel breakdown. We have the retest. And then we, we broke underneath. We got rejected above this red line. See this? This is a rejection above the red line. We should dump, but we're not dumping. We dumped and then we went back up. That's really weird. So that cost me a little bit of money. But now uh, that uh, I've taken that and upgraded my algorithm, you know why? It's because of this. Here. <clears throat> It's because the artificial intelligence bots know that I was expecting a dump right here. And what they did was they slowed their dumping down. They just slowed down their dumping so that it would just confuse the heck out of people like me who have Asperger's or Asperger's. And, ah, shit, I should be shorting right now. Oh, look at that. We're still... We're, we're, for now, we're not bullish, okay? We're just not bullish for now. Um... But if you didn't get the signal to sell uh, right about here, right about here, if you didn't get the signal to dump, um, there's a way to fix that problem. I join this here. All the big moves, even if uh, no matter what, no matter what level you join, whether you don't even eat, eat, whether you join this level, whether you join this level, or whether you join this level, all the big moves, the tops and the bottoms, I tell you, I tell everybody that's a community member. All the tops and the bottoms. But if you want leverage and you want scalps all day long for professional day traders, uh, you need to join this group. Actually, either one of these groups. Silver tier or gold tier. The only difference is gold, I give you leverage. But you get the same amount of signals. Hmm, actually, silver gets a few less because if you use leverage, you can make money on a half a percent move. Literally, it's only going to move up a half a percent. You can still make a ton of money with a thousand X long. Thousand X? Yeah, we do it all day long. Well, we... Don't exactly. The most would go up um, reliably is about 500 to 600 X leverage. So if you want to use leverage, it's this room. Uh, if you don't want to use leverage, it's this room. And you're going to know to dump the top here because that's what we did here. Um, and you're going to know to dump. Uh, this doesn't look like it dumped much, but it did. Uh, here. Oh, shit. Anyway, you get the picture. Uh, Live long and prosper, I guess. Um, join this. I want to make you rich. You gonna let me?